Hello friends, let us have a quick review of the gross anatomical features of the pancreas. What we see here is specimen of pancreas along with some part of the duodenum. Now pancreas has got four parts, the head, the narrow neck, the body and the tail. Head has two surfaces, anterior surface and a posterior surface. Four borders, superior border, right border, inferior border and the left border which continues as the neck. Inferior border shows a hook like process that is the uncinate process. The neck of the pancreas is flat having anterior and posterior surfaces and superior border and inferior border. The body is triangular in section having three borders, superior border, inferior border and an anterior border and three surfaces, antero superior surface, antero inferior surface and the flat posterior surface. Tail is the tapering part having anterior and posterior surfaces. Then we go on to see which part of the pancreas is intraperitoneal. It is only the tail which is intraperitoneal, rest of the parts are retroperitoneal. The openings of the two pancreatic ducts, the major pancreatic duct joins with the bile duct to form the common bile duct which opens at the major duodenal papilla which lies 10 cm distal to the pyloric opening at the posteromedial border of the second part of the duodenum while the accessory pancreatic duct opens at the minor duodenal papilla which lies 2 cm above the initial opening of the major duodenal papilla. Thank you.